Assalamu alaikum and hello everybody. I hope you're all doing really well. Ramadan Mubarak. I hope your Ramadan is going wonderfully. So in this video, I'm sharing three really delicious ideas for seri or suhoor or the pre-dawn meal. So if you've got the energy when you wake up at about 3, 4 in the morning, make yourself one of these and you'll be good to go for the rest of the day. So the first recipe I share with you is a really quick and easy one. It's some Nutella and banana on some fried bread. I know it sounds amazing, doesn't it? it tastes really yummy, mashallah. So I've got a couple of slices of bread. I cut the crust off and I'm just spreading on some milk chocolate spread. A generous, delicious amount. And then I topped with a couple of banana slices and then I've got some chopped hazelnuts. Just put the bread slices together and then press the edges with a fork just to keep everything closed and not spilling out. You can mix up your fillings. I'm sure you'll come up with some wonderful ideas. So I've lightly sprayed a frying pan and you're just going to fry the toasty on the frying pan for a minute or two. And it's really nice and crunchy and sweet and delicious. So the next idea is some egg with baranta, but not just egg with baranta. It's like a, it's like a quesadilla. It's basically omelette and cheese sandwich between two barantas. So I've diced some tomatoes and onions and then cracked a load of eggs into this mixing bowl. I did some salt, garlic granules, some paprika and some pepper and just give that a nice salt whisk. And then add in your diced tomato and onion, mixing it all together really well. So these are the chapatis or the brantas that I used. These ones were actually quite small. Some bigger ones would have been nicer because they'd have filled the pan up fully, but it's fine. So I've cooked the brantas or the chapatis and then I poured a ladle full of the egg or omelette. So you put the baranta on top of the almost cooked egg, flip it over, sprinkle over some grated cheese and then put another baranta on top. Give it another flip and then cook it for like a minute or two when it's ready. And it is actually really, really delicious, mashallah. It's got all the delicious flavours you want and it's got that crunch and crispiness. The third idea for suhoor is this bread and butter pudding. It'll take a little bit longer than the other two, but you can make a big portion, so it's good for a big family. So first of all, I buttered an oven dish And then I've got some bread slices. Again, I'm taking the crust off. Mm -hmm. 
Next, I spread some softened butter on the bread slices. And then once I'd buttered the bread, I quartered into little triangles the bread and then laid them on the oven dish, as you can see. So I was just getting the zest from a lemon. And I added some sultanas and the lemon zest and then prepared another layer of bread slices, buttered bread slices. Oh yes, indeed. And then topped with another layer of sultanas and a little bit more lemon zest. So in a pan, I added some milk and some double cream. Give it a little whisk. There you go. And then when it came to the boil, turn the heat off. In a large mixing bowl, I added some eggs, sugar, gave that a little whisk. And then I poured in the milk mixture whisked it again added a little bit of vanilla extract whisked it again and then you just need to pour that mixture into a jug um, sifting it to get rid of any eggy lumps and then pour that mixture all over the bread in the oven dish soaking all that delightful bread I love cinnamon powder so I added some of that and then uh, topped with about two tablespoons of demerara sugar which gave it a really delicious crunch. Try to add it if you can. Then you need to bake the bread and butter pudding in the oven and it comes out looking gorgeous like that mashallah. It is really delicious mashallah and the family enjoyed it. Anyway, I hope this video gave you some ideas for what to have at Seri or Suhoor if you're struggling at that time. Jazakallah, thank you so much for watching. And inshallah, I'll see you in my next video. Take care, salam, bye.